Hi! Today I'm going to talk about my knees. Both of my knees have this thing called a lateral discoid meniscus. From what people have told me, a meniscus is sort of like the cartilage muscly cushion that's underneath your kneecap. Well, mine likes to slide in and out of place. So I learned that I had this thing when I was in second grade. I was sitting crisscross applesauce and I was reading my book. I leaned forward and I heard two pops in both my knees locked in place. I could not straighten them. I could not move them without being in extreme pain. I started screaming in the middle of silent reading time because I didn't know what was going on. Later, they straightened my legs. Popped knees, as I coined the term, because it popped out of place and it has to be popped back. It hurts if you move it, if you touch it. And it hurts even more when you try to straighten it because you are actually pulling it back into place. You're gotta snap it back. I began to learn how to avoid positions that would make my knees pop. First there was crisscross applesauce, um, then there was getting in a car and getting out of a car because of the sideways motion. There was uh, putting on my shoes one time, sitting sideways on the floor, um, once playing Twister. That was not such a good idea. But the reason I'm telling you this is because last week it popped again. Last week was the scariest time it happened because A, it hasn't popped in the last two years, so I thought maybe it would be getting better, so I wasn't expecting it. And two, I was alone. I was downstairs uh, eating breakfast and I just turned in my chair and my knee popped. One of my housemates was sleeping and the other one was probably getting ready for school. And so I started calling for them to come downstairs and apparently they didn't hear me. And so I called a friend, uh, got a voicemail. It felt like an eternity, but I, I had been crying and yelling for seven or eight minutes. I'd called a friend, no one was answering, no one could hear me. Finally, I just screamed. And finally my housemates came downstairs and they straightened it for me. It's been weighing on my heart for the last couple days because it's, it was a nightmare and I keep thinking about it and I keep thinking about how it could happen again but in a worse situation where I really am alone. And even when it's not popping in both my knees, no matter what I'm doing, it's this constant pain. I mean, it's not the same level of pain as the popping but it's still constant enough that it's annoying. It can range from little tiny sewing needles just pricking in and out of my knees to knitting needles working their way in. I know that this isn't the worst pain in the world. That doesn't mean it doesn't hurt or that my knees don't pop. That's a reality. Well, that was a fun video. <laughs> Sorry if I bummed you out. I'm just trying to be honest and I want to open up conversations. You can ask me questions if you want. Again, this community is rather quiet. I don't know if it can be even be called a community yet, which is sad. Anyway, bye!